because the one thing I enjoy is like homemade or whatever. So I don't care what it is, but that's the one stipulation. So let's talk about that more. So let's go and look at it. if we have a triangle ABC where B equals 12.4, C equals 8.7, and A equals 23 degrees. So what we need to do is we need to now figure out, um, actually, I don't even know. What is the question asking us to do? They want us to find A. So let's go ahead and draw what this triangle is going to look like. And it doesn't really matter how you draw the triangle. Let's just do A, B, and C. So we know A is 23 degrees. B equals 12.4. Remember, the A, B, and C, the lowercase, are always opposite of their angle, right? So we have B equals 12.4. And C equals 8.7. All right. So now the next thing we need to do is we need to look at this and to figure out, to find our values, ladies and gentlemen, we need to remember, all right, if it was a right triangle, we could use sine, cosine, and tangent, right? But we don't know if it's a right triangle. We can't prove that it's a right triangle. We only know one angle. So we could look at the law of sines. Now to remember to use the law of sines, you have to have an angle and its, a po and its opposite side length. So do we have any angle on its opposite side length? No, we don't, right? So therefore, we have to use the other law, which was law of cosines, which you guys will be for provided with this as well. So, um, but yeah, now we need to go ahead and use the law of cosines for this problem. So they're asking us to find A. So I can write out A as going to be, if you guys, A squared equals b squared plus c squared minus 2 times b times c times the cosine of a. And this is me just going off my memory, so I just want to double check it. Equals b squared plus c squared minus 2 times b times c times cosine of a. Awesome. All right, so now we just need to plug in what we need to figure out and then solve for a. So we don't know what a is, but we know b squared is 12.4 plus c squared, which is 8.7 minus 2 times b times c times the cosine of 23 degrees. All right, so let's just do these separately, and then we'll add them all up together. All right, so I do 12.4 squared equals 153.76 plus 8.7 squared. equals 75.69. And then I'll do negative 2 times 12.4 times 8.7 times the cosine of 23 equals negative 198.61. Oh, almost done. So therefore, I have 153.76 plus 75.69 minus 198.61, that equals, hold on, 30.84. And then remember that equals a squared, so I root it. Excuse me, excuse me, sit down, sit down. Thank you. So therefore, I'm going to take the square root of that. Square root of 30.84, and therefore, a equals 5.55. There you go. I haven't decided yet. Hold on, Mika. There you go. It'll, I haven't decided yet.